Have you ever opened a bottle of dish soap and that smell almost stings your nose? That's not just your imagination. That's your body warning you. If it feels harsh, just breathing it in, imagine what happens when traces of that soap coat your dishes and end up inside your gut with every meal. Think about it. Your plate is like the runway where your food takes off into your body. And if that runway is covered in a thin film of chemicals, every bite you take carries those toxins deeper inside. And most people think dish soaps are harmless, just bubbles and foam, but here's the toxic truth. Many conventional dish soaps are filled with synthetic fragrances, dyes, and chemical preservatives that release volatile organic compounds. And a study in the journal Indoor Ear showed that household cleaning products are a major source of indoor volatile organic compounds, which can irritate the lungs, trigger headaches, and even affect the nervous system. And if you ever felt lightheaded while cleaning, it wasn't in your head. It was chemistry hitting your brain. And it doesn't stop there. And a 2023 study in the Journal of Allergy and Clinical Immunology found that Alcohol, ethocholates, common detergent ingredients can disrupt the intestinal barrier and trigger inflammation. Even at concentrations similar what might remain on dishware, your gut lining, like a coffee filter letting nutrients through while blocking toxins, but with constant chemical exposure, holes form, and suddenly irritants that should have been stopped slip into your bloodstream, igniting immune stress and inflammation. And here's another analogy. Imagine your gut lining like a window screen. Normally, it keeps the bugs out while letting the breeze through. But spray it with harsh chemicals day after day and holes appear. Suddenly, everything unwanted is getting inside. That's what dish soap residues can do to your body over time. But here's something else you need to know. Some dish soaps are labeled as antibacterial. And that might sound like a good thing, right? But research shows otherwise. And for years, many of these products contain triclosan, an antibacterial chemical that the FDA eventually banned from hand soaps in 2016 because it was linked to hormone disruption, antibiotic resistance, and environmental damage. A review published in the Environmental Science and Technology warned that triclosan can accumulate in the body, disrupt the thyroid hormones, and impact fertility. Even when triclosan isn't present, other antibacterial additives can interfere with your natural microbiome. Remember, not all bacteria are bad. Your gut depends on healthy bacteria for digestion, your immunity, even mood regulation. When chemical antibacterials wash into your daily life day after day, they just don't attack germs on your plates. They can also disrupt the delicate balance of good bacteria in your body. And once they wash down the drain, they persist in the environment, fueling antibiotic resistance and harming aquatic life. So what about killing bacteria naturally? The truth is you don't even need antibacterial chemicals in dish soap. Regular soap with water already breaks down the grease and physically lifts germs away. The FDA has confirmed there's no evidence that antibacterial dish soaps are more effective than plain soap with water for everyday cleaning. But if you want extra reassurance, there are safe, natural ways to boost antibacterial action without toxic side effects. White vinegar contains acetic acid, and research in food control showed that vinegar effectively reduces microbial contamination on food contact surfaces. Lemon juice, it's natural citric acid. It's another powerful antibacterial and deodorizer. Baking soda, combined with hot water, adds scrubbing power and freshness. Hydrogen peroxide in low concentrations like 3% has been shown in studies to kill a wide range of bacteria and viruses safely on kitchen surfaces. And essential oils like tea tree, thyme, oregano, and lavender, they contain natural compounds such as thymol and turbinin for all that science has proven to be antimicrobial. 
just like a drop or two of do-it-yourself soap mix can add antibacterial protection without the risk of chemicals like triclosan. These are simple, safe tools that you can use at home every day. And let's make this interactive. Try this test. Wash a glass, rinse it, then fill it with plain water. Smell it. If you still notice a soapy fragrance, that's residue. And if you can smell it, you can swallow it. Another challenge, grab your dish soap, read the ingredients. If it looks like a science experiment with words you can't pronounce, that's your clue. Now here's the part most people don't think about. It's not just you, that coffee mug you sip every morning, the fork your children eat with, the baby bottle you rinse for the little one, all of those may be carrying tiny traces of these chemicals. And children with smaller and more sensitive systems are even more vulnerable. If soap residue can irritate your gut, imagine what it does to theirs. But here's the good news. Clean dishes don't require dirty chemistry. There are safe options backed by research. Studies show that plant-based surfactants derived from coconut or corn clean effectively without leaving harsh residues. So let me put it like this. You wouldn't pump toxic sludge into your car's engine and expect it to run smooth, would you? But many people are doing the same thing to their bodies by washing their dishes with chemicals that damage their lungs, their gut, as well as their brain. And dish soap touches you three times when you breathe it in, when it contacts your skin, and when you swallow the residue that's left behind. And that's why this matters. Changing your dish soap seems small, but it's one of those daily habits that stacks up over years. It's not about fear. It's about smarter choices, backed by science. Swap one bottle and you protect your health, your family, your gut, your lungs, and the planet. Because the truth is, the strongest cleaner in your home is not what's in the bottle. It's your awareness. And now that you know the toxic truth, you'll never look at a dish soap the same way ever again. And if this opened your eyes, I ask you please, to share it with someone that you care about and love because we all deserve to know the truth about what's hiding in our kitchens. I hope you enjoyed this video and most important, make it a great day. I'm Dr. Alan Mandel.